You're all in. Ready to be dispatched. That is all is enough to go for the Evrinsky Trophy. You've been dispatched by all the runners. And as they settle down to race, and it's Anna, just the leader from Float King, and one life to love, quickly move up on the outside to join up with the front runners, and making a quick forward on the outside to take over the running is uh, Cheryl. Cheryl on the outside now decides to take it up by about three quarters of a length. Now a length in front of uh, Anna running second. Then comes one life to love. Dropping back to run fourth at the stage is Fruit King with Scorching Ace keeping company. Zulu Punch is not far behind. Further length behind comes the next is uh, Seven Heaven. And another two and a half lengths behind is Fire Star. They travel towards the 600 meter mark and it's uh, still Cheryl the leader by about uh, a length in front of Anna running second. One life to love is settled back to run third. Two and a half lengths behind is Fruit King and Zulu Punch has been given a, a reminder. Trailing about five wide off the fence is Scorching Ace as they straighten up for the final run. And Cheryl comes to home first, the leader, by about uh, a length and a half in front of Anna in second. One life to love is manoeuvring his way in between dollars and starting to bridge the gap on the outside. Another two and a half, three lengths behind is Scorching Ace. But one life to love comes up with a smooth transition to take it up by about three quarters. A length in front of Cheryl, then comes Anna. For racing inside the final 50 and one life to love is going to lift the Evrinsky Trophy from uh, Cheryl finishing on second. Anna and it's up third. Then comes Seven Evans, Scorching Ace. For the back is uh, Zulu Punch. Then we have Fruit King ending up last as Fire Star.